What's up, what's up, what's up? You already know, this is Peach. And today, I'm taking y'all with me into Dollar Tree. Y'all know this is my bazaar. We need some household stuff. Now we are at the Dollar Tree in the inner city. So, they might not have nothing I need. We gonna hope for the best that they got it. If they don't got it, then I'll probably go out to the Dollar Tree like more in the country, where I know we'll have some stuff. Let's go! Face mask. Everywhere in Hillsboro, I don't need. All right, y'all. This line long. Let's hope they got what I want. Like, I want tissue. I bought tissue out of Dollar Tree and bleach. And dish detergent and garbage bags. I definitely need garbage bags. And some paper plates. We have quantity limits still. They got tissue and paper towels, but it's only four per customer. So we're gonna get four of these paper towels. I like buying them out of here instead. I really like the bouncy ones that they sell, but they don't have any of those. So I'm gonna see if I can get somebody to get me four of those. They way up high. We're gonna get four of those. And then I'm gonna get two paper plates. I either buy paper plates out of here or sometimes I'll go to Walmart and I'll buy a big thing for $3.98. They barely got paper plates. They don't got the paper plates I like. So they don't have paper plates that I like. I'll have to get them out of Walmart. They do sell these little food cartons like this out of to go trade and Dollar Tree get 10 for a dollar. A lot of people don't know that. We get these when we go on a party. We buy our own pack and take it with us to the family barbecue. And then we hide our plates in our car because so they be stealing to go plates in our My family. favorite tissue, the Scott's. We gonna get four of these. It's my absolute favorite. I buy these every time I come in Dollar Tree. That's the rule. Anytime I go in Dollar Tree, I gotta buy tissue. And anytime I go in Walmart, I buy diapers. It don't matter what I'm going in there for, that's a rule. That's how I stay stocked with diapers and um other stuff. I buy little dish detergents out of here to keep under the sink in my children's bathroom. I like palm olives. I prefer the purple kinds or the dark blue kind. They don't have any of those, so we'll just get three of these and I don't know I like this kind better than this kind that's 12.6 ounces this is 10 ounces but I still like this kind better it works better y'all know all my hair friends like I got my weave in right now I want to take it out nobody don't want to cut it out but all my friends do hair this is a secret this is how you wash the lace glue out of your wigs Dawn dish detergent just so you know don't say I ain't never put you on nothing, sis. Brooms and stuff out of here, not mops, because the mops are like too flimsy, look at that. What you gonna mop with this? But I do be buying brooms out of here. They don't look like they got none. I'm just gonna get me a new dustpan, because it's only a dollar. We are gonna get this big one. I'm gonna get this big dustpan for a dollar. I was debating if I should get that little tiny one. We are gonna go ahead and go for the big one. The next thing I gotta get out of here is some comments. My handy dandy comment. We only need one. This one can of comment will last you like four months, maybe six. Uh, this one can for one dollar. I promise you. Get you one, sis. I also buy my pot scrapers out of here, and I know this how I'm running my pots, but I love these things. I like the silver ones. They gotta be the shiny silver ones, not the ones with brown. Like these brown ones, they rust, and they'll turn your sink brown and your dishes brown. I don't really like this silver one either. This is not the kind I normally buy. Cause they were like, they got a little tint of, of the other color in them. I like to get the three pack silver ones, but they don't got none at this location. We just gonna buy this one just to keep as a backup. And then I'll also get a sponge just to have, look at this duster. Child, they got dollar dusters. If y'all need to dust off them dusty behind fans and AC vents. I got a duster from Walmart for like $7. I'm mad. I wish I would've came in here. But I'm about sponge. They even got these. Wow. The little Swiffer refills. Child Dollar Tree be having everything. I'm gonna have to tell my mama that. That she used that. I'm gonna get one of these sponges. Okay, we're just gonna get that to have. I need a new brush. I buy my brush here. Y'all know when I cleaned my tub, I didn't have a brush. This is the brush I use. They're a dollar. And these last a pretty long time. I ain't gonna get that one. That one look all bent up. 
we gonna get this one. It look a little better. Let's see if I can find one that look better than that. All right, I found the perfect one. We gonna get this one. I've bought in this too before y'all. This worked really good. If you wanna scrub your dishes, you put the dish detergent in there. I'm gonna get this instead of that sponge. This worked really, really good. You put your dish detergent in there and when you're squeezing it with the water, it come out and it's only a dollar. We're gonna get that and we're gonna put these sponges back. Put this back. The thing I'm gonna get is this, I love my carpet. So they got the little carpet fresheners, the arm and hammers and all that. They barely got a lot of stuff. But this right here is the last one, baby. Don't say I ain't put y'all on. This thing smells so good. It's killing the expensive carpet cleaners. This is so freaking good. So this is the last one. I'm telling y'all, turning y'all on right now. I've been using this for years. How your whole house smelling so good. So now we at the bathroom cleaners for everybody that was wanting to know what I use. I use this. It's one dollar. This one can gonna last you at least three months. Unless you got a bunch of bathrooms, but literally a little goes a long way. I'm just gonna only buy one can, that's all I need. I also buy this carpet cleaner for a dollar. It's a foam spray. They got a bunch of these, they got them in different spots. But these um, carpet cleaner foam sprays, I spray my couch down with this. I have kids, I allow my kids to sit on my carpet. I allow them to eat on the couch. So I'll be having to clean it. I use this in some water and it'd be clean. So this is what we looking like. My buddy all unorganized. Now we're gonna get to the hood shit. The good shit. Fabuloso. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. so y'all know that I did a video. Some of y'all know. I did a video cleaning out the smell of like seafood. And I used my lemon and my cinnamon. But this is the hood shit. The hood shit, the good shit. You want to get you some Fabuloso, honey. You want to have you some of this at all times. When we're on up hood, you got to have it at all times. Now they got all the colors. They got, you know, the purple, which is the classic color. This is what everybody start out with. When you start using Fabuloso, you start out with the purple. Then when you get fancy, you get the blue. When you, you know, you get fancy and you're trying to be bougie. And when you're real big time, you get the green. Because they got all three of these flavors, we're going to get all three. We're going to have us some fun making some videos. Let's the get off. Ajax one. I hate Ajax. Growing up, that's all my mama used was Ajax. You can get a big old thing of Ajax for a dollar. I don't mess with Ajax. I am big time now. I am big time. We don't mess with Ajax. But they got some. Y'all try it. Tell me if y'all like that. My children's father loves this awesome. He has a car wash. He used this degreaser. It's a degreaser. He used this when he shampooing seats. That's a, a secret. If you want to get your car shampooed, get out them stains out your seat, this is this one little dollar bottle, baby, it'll change your life. Some pine salt. Now they got this pine glow. This is how they be getting. You get this big ass pine glow. I'm sorry, let me not cuss. You get this big old pine glow for one dollar, but I don't like pine glow. I like pine salt. So I'm gonna get this. I like to mop my flow with this every now and again. It just make me think about when I was little growing up in the projects and how we couldn't afford pine salt. But if we went to my grandma's house, my grandma that had money on my daddy's side, she was using pine saw, and I was like, when I grow up, I ain't using Ajax and Fabuloso. I'm using pine saw. So I like to keep this and do it every now and again. Bags. I buy my bags from Dollar Tree. These are my favorite. These good scents. It's seven. Sometimes they have the ones with nine. It'll have like a slash through and it's a bonus and they have nine instead. These bags work good. They don't rip easily. I swear by these. I'm going to get five of these. And I only like this kind of flip ties. They fit my garbage perfect. I got like a 13 gallon garbage. They fit perfect and they're easy to tie and they don't rip open. They last in my house. So this is it. And then if you like to put, put your man out, get you some of these. Sus, I swear to God, these work. They will hold them Jordans. They will hold them Tim, some Trues. These work, you could black paper bag, black garbage bag, his stuff, get them right out your house. Sus, get you some of these. Don't say I ain't put you on. Get out of Dollar Tree is these glad bags. I buy these healthy ones too. These slider quartz. I make sure I keep at least one of these at all times. They normally have the freezer bags too, but I haven't been seeing them lately. Which one is this? That's a snack snack. Yeah, I haven't been seeing the freezer ones lately. They've been gone. But I normally buy the freezer ones too. But we're going to get this 
hefty eight slider bags. They're real big, they're quart size. And then we're gonna get the snack bags collections. Oh, and these bags right here are the bomb. They so tiny. If you're gonna have a birthday party or something, when my kids them celebrating something at school, I buy these and they're really small and I could put all the little candies in here and not have to worry about buying no theme bags, but they got the theme kind too. So for those of you who having birthday parties and stuff, I'm sure I don't care what kind of bags they in. As long as the candy well, now we are in the cutlery aisle. I love this knife. This one dollar knife right here. This is the knife that I be using on my videos. And I be like, oh, you need a new knife, sis. You need a new knife. This is the knife. I love this knife. One dollar. But y'all was suggesting that I get a silicone knife and get some wood and stuff so I can stop messing up my pots and feeding my children toxic stuff, etc., etc., etc. I'm not seeing any of those. They say Dollar Tree has them. I'm not seeing any. I see like these silicone spatulas, silicone spoons, which I've never noticed these before. I'm gonna grab some of those since y'all don't brought. Look at this, this is too cute. I've never noticed these before, but y'all said they got silicone knives. I'm not seeing any. Maybe they have them at a different location that I could check out. So yeah, I don't want sticks. These right here, I make sure I have these all the time. I always be making um kebab. I call them shish kebab. Those silicone things. I'm not sure if I want to buy this. It's cute. If they had pink, I would definitely buy it. I think I'm going to wait until I find another Dollar Tree that got like a whole set of colors I like. But this is what everybody's telling me to start using. Silicone spoons, silicone knives, and silicone spatulas and stuff. Do y'all use this? Comment down below if y'all use this. It's a silicone spoon. This blue is cute. If I can't find pink at another Dollar Tree, I'll probably end up buying blue. But this one look kind of real dirty. I don't know if y'all can see that looks real dirty, so I ain't getting that. I'll wait till I go to another one. I'm going to buy one because the one I got is really old. But I got one of those black ones that just easily stick. I'm going to try this because I might show y'all how I wash my dishes. And y'all gonna be talking about my sink style. So let's get this and see if that works. Not that I really care about what y'all gotta say about me. I really don't care that much. We gonna buy some toothpicks too. Cause baby, we finna be eating some steak. This the thing. I seen somebody selling a set of like household stuff. Y'all gotta start coming to Dollar Tree. This one, like I say, is in the inner city. So we be on Dollar Tree heavy. Maybe if we go in the country, I could find one or more stuff. But they be having the cutest stuff for your kitchen like the cutest stuff look live your dream maybe have i had a coffee set out of here this set i had my house this coffee set but now where i live at now i have a gas stove so i'm very hesitant to put this kind of stuff in my house with a gas stove they had the coffee placemats they don't really got nothing in here this one about empty i do not drink alcohol of any sort never have do not do drugs of any sort never drank um or did drugs ever in my life fun fact but i love drinking juice out of wine glasses and this wine glass caught my eye i think it is too cute what y'all think i think i'm gonna go buy this i love to put it like with ice strawberries and water and stuff and just drink and i feel very mature light a candle so we buy coffee mug girl but for those of you who don't normally shop at dollar tree they be having all the cute mugs, y'all, in the cute plates. I've been dying. I've been eyeing this plate for the longest. Like, because this is really in this kind of marble print. But it's like, feels like plastic. It's not glass. But they look like in style. A lot of people into this right now. Tiles, black splash. I like that plate, but I don't want to buy it. But I look at it every time I come into a Dollar Tree. I look at that plate. I be buying these cups as well for my kids, but they stay loose on the top. And then sometimes they'll just pour this straight out on the ground. That's why I like the BPA cups, BPA free cups from Walmart that you see me buy when I went grocery shopping. I prefer those better versus these. They're only a dollar and they're cute. They got different characters. However, all of them just easy to just like, whoosh. especially my two year old, look how big that hole. My two year old will take one of these bottles. She had one like, Minnie Mouse from out of here and just squeeze it directly on the carpet. So I just avoid buying those now. I don't buy those. On to the floor. A lot of people swear by Reynolds wrap. 
this stuff right here but it's a dollar for only 15 square feet i don't mess with that i use this for one dollar you're getting 40 square feet i got these at home already but i'm about two more i always try to keep my house stocked with tissue soap dish detergent bleach foil anything we could need because you never know if you're gonna be broke and you can't afford those things so we just try to keep it and stop we trying to never be broke again like young nba young boy never broke again but in the meantime i just try to keep my house fully stocked at all times um i always buy metal plates i mean metal pans out of here these little disposable metal plant pans and i keep some right now i got like four at home i'm only gonna buy one more and i'm gonna do like a lasagna pan those are the ones i like to buy out of here that's the cake little lasagna pans i like so i'm not gonna worry about it I, I might just buy this cake pan and we could just do some cake today with the kids now they also have like bread and stuff at the dollar tree for one dollar miracle whip my name brand mayonnaise for a dollar it's small versus it's generic but name brand i bought some cinnamon out of here one time and I still use it to this day. Look, they even got bacon bites. I didn't know they had all this. Come through Dollar Tree. They be having A1 sauce too. They don't look like they got none at this one. They got Kraft Italian dressing, y'all. Name brand. Name brand. Raspberry. They got wishbone balsamic vinaigrette. They got that classic ranch. I don't see no blue cheese. I like blue cheese. We eat blue cheese. They even got non-stick spray. Y'all know I be buying Pam, but... I might try these one day. So don't sleep on the Dollar Tree now. They got the generic steak sauce right here, but some of them have the real A1 steak sauce for one dollar. They be that same size because my brother, it's just him. He stay buying his grocery stuff out of Dollar Tree because it's more economical for him and the sizes are just right for him. So don't sleep, like I said, on the Dollar Tree for they food. I want to point out that Dollar Tree, y'all, they sell a dozen eggs for $1. I don't buy eggs because I get them free with WIC. But, you know, if you are struggling or you just like to save money, ain't nothing wrong with this food. It don't be expired. I like to buy ice cream out of here. I don't see the kind that my kids like. It's like all the ice cream gone. But I like to buy ice cream out of here. Look, they even got these little corn dogs. You're getting two for $1. This plastic hot dog, I ain't never seen that before. These right here good. I buy these from Save A Lot for 89 cents. Them things be so good. Yeah, ice cream, y'all, that's crazy, no ice cream. big tomato sauces for a dollar. I need to buy these when I'm doing my um, Uncle John sausage with rice and tomatoes. They got diced tomatoes. And they got name brand stuff, y'all. Name brand, I got a coffee. They got the little bags of cereal, these. I got one friend, she don't get food stamps or nothing. She always buy these for her kids. She be like, this lasts her at least three bowls of cereal. I'll get those for like a snack if we on the go. I'll get them and my kids can eat them dry while we're driving somewhere. They even got cake mix, Pillsbury cake mix. What is this? Perfect size. Is this supposed to be a microwavable cake? Wow, I've never seen this before. Y'all see this? Child, this expired. Best by March 2020. I'm up here saying this stuff don't be expired. And this, baby, that's expired. Ooh, baby, Dollar Tree tighten up. Yeah, I went and buy these out of here because I could get them cheaper. These don't expire till 2022. These SpaghettiOs are here be banging. It's a bigger size than Walmart. Maybe this might be a better place to buy these. These expire December of 2021. That's why you don't give your canned goods away. And people are like, you have too much food, give it away. Canned goods are considered non-perishables and they last a long time. They got chemicals in there that some people say it's not healthy, but they last a long time. So I stockpile shop for those reasons. I'm taking out my sew in. But the issue is they don't have any other elastics. I like, I buy these elastics out of here to put on my ponytails, but they ain't got none at this location. We be knowing, you know, about the good stuff in the Dollar Tree. I'm going to just get this and hope that these will work. Like, they're, they're stretchy enough. 
but normally it's some thin elastic bands that I buy out of here and they're big like this. And I can put my hair in like the easiest ponytail ever. None of the stuff I like. I'm gonna get this comb because I'm about to do my hair. This big comb, you can hang it around your shower. It works. I'm natural, y'all. got a lot of hair, like thick hair. I buy my bonnets out of here, like the bonnet I got on now I got out of here. But it don't look like they got none of that right now. Mm-mm-mm. No bonnets. Is, buy your socks out of Dollar Tree. You get three for a dollar. Like during back to school season, we get our kids socks out of Dollar Tree. Three for a dollar. No excuse to have them dirty socks, them holy socks. Buy your socks. The baby socks, you only get two pair for a dollar. So I don't recommend this because you could get a better deal somewhere else. Like I just bought my baby 60 pair of socks for four dollars. But still cool. People be buying laundry baskets out of here too. Oh my God, look at what they sell in doorknob covers. I'm gonna buy these. I had just bought a pack out of Walmart and I paid like $10 and they got them in here for a dollar. Don't sleep on the Dollar Tree, I'm buying that. Is this the cabinet lock? I'm buying this. Cause baby is on go, we gonna get two of these. This cute too, a disposable placement. I'm not wasting my money on that, but that's cute. But I definitely needed those door locks. I did not know they sell the hooks. They're okay. Like if you need a tower hook, I have used these before. They're pretty good. This one is more sturdy than this one. My oldest one has this in his room under behind his door. But when I got big time, oh, this is the one you want to get. This right here, it's one dollar. You know, I used to have this. I had this for like a year, but then I got all big time and I got me a cute bougie one with diamonds on it for like 10 bucks. But in the meantime, if you need a over the door hook, I definitely recommend that one. That would be choice number one. Choice number two would be this, it would be this one, this kind. And then final choice would be this because this one is a little flimsy, but that one works really well. The stuff they barely got, the stuff that I would tell you to buy. They normally have like even the packs of Huggies. What is this? This is diapers. This is not bad. You're getting five, four packs, of di four pair of diapers for a dollar. That's not bad if you're struggling. It's no excuse to have your children without diapers because you're getting four for a dollar. They be having huggies. They like they go on. They normally right here. They'll give you one huggy for a dollar. I'm not really a huggy fan. I'll use huggies if I coupon for it. But I think off-brand diapers work better because they hold more. And this diaper rash cream, that works good too, y'all. I've used that before, that works well. But yeah, there's nothing in here I want. My youngest son, he asked me to buy this finger paint, but I'm like, I think that's a disaster waiting to happen. I'm not buying that. My second youngest son, they're like almost out of all the good soaps that you like. We'll use Dial, but I don't buy my soap from Dollar Tree unless I'm like broke or I just need one bar of soap until I go to the store. I don't buy my soap. Oh, the again. bonnet. This is where I buy my bonnets from. This is the bonnet I got on my head. They ain't got no other design right now. It look like all this, but they be having different prints. Let me see. Is this the same? No, this is a different print. So we gonna buy that one. I love my bonnets. I know y'all think that's so ghetto, but baby, I love my bonnets. blue is this the same i'm like is it the same and it's showing different sections of it yeah maybe they're the same, same. so i'm just gonna get this blue one i'm gonna get this and this one i'm not gonna get these because they look like the same one i got on i don't think they're gonna be anything different in the inside we'll see like i don't know if it's folded different that's why it look different See that pink like maybe it's just folded different so i'm saying different parts of the same bunny it don't matter they're a dollar you can't never have, have too many bunnies make sure you always keep your few keep your some in your car some in the bathroom some next to your bed can't never have too many bunnies two brushes every time i come in dollar tree i either get this one for a dollar because in case you have a guest or your kids, you don't put your toothbrush in the toilet. Yes, kids do stuff like that. Just keep these on deck. And then I also get toothpaste out of here. But they don't got the kind I use. It's like gone. And I make sure I get my kids some toothbrushes just to keep 
if they stay losing a toothbrush, we just gonna get these for a dollar and just keep them in the house in case we need them. And the stand wheel cover, I'm gonna try this red one and see if it'll fit on my stand wheel. It's a dollar. These night lights, a dollar. Everything in here a dollar. Why am I telling y'all it's a dollar? Like the Dollar Tree. Everything in here is a dollar. Stop saying it's a dollar. Gene. Popular cotton. Like it's even a cotton Facebook group. People like say it's a part of their heritage. People from the south. I just pulled that cotton off. We going like, we didn't see that. But they say it's a part of their heritage. A lot of black people get mad about this. They say it's offensive. But I think it's pretty. I think the cotton with the pine cones is pretty. I would buy that and put it in my house. These are their little fake flowers. So if you're into the whole cotton thing, you might want to check out the Dollar Tree. They got some in here. I'm so ashy. I need to buy lotion while I'm in here. Girl, stop being ashy on camera. This. And ribbons and stuff. For all the little DIY people. Right, so okay. I'm done with Dollar Tree. So now I stopped by the meat store. I have meat at home still. But I didn't thaw anything out. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to go home. I'm going to cook and clean and just stay home for the rest of the day. I'm not coming back outside. So instead of having to wait to thaw out some meat, I'm just going to come buy meat i'm at the meat store i'm debating if i want to do ribs we just had chicken wings last night so i think we over chicken so i'm like i'm either gonna do ribs or i could do hmm ribs pork chop or stew beef i'm debating all right y'all i'm just gonna upload my video separate i'll do a separate video of my other shopping trips i want to thank y'all for watching if you enjoyed this video you already know what to do hit a like you like hit a like you like hit a like you like for your girl bye